welcome to this week's tip of the week. Now we're up to the letter R. You're probably wondering why I've got hold of a tennis racket here, although we're on a golf course. So I'm sure we've all got a little bit of knowledge about how to play tennis. So when we're playing tennis and we're creating a really nice forehand shot, that one that gives us a lot of speed and a lot of power over the net. What's happening to create that speed and power is a lot of top spin. And we gain that by actually releasing the tennis racket. What I find a lot in golf, a lot of us cut across the golf ball, we reduce the amount of speed that we create, and we obviously get a little bit of backspin or side spin, which then makes that shot not so good. So what we're gonna do today, I always like to feel once I've hit the golf ball that my right hand is actually shaking hands with the target. That's going to allow for us to gain a lot more speed, a lot more control to make that ball go down the middle of the fairway. So let's, let's give it a go.